guys, it's fall time. And are you ready for a fall tag? Well, let's get started. Okay, this is the Jazzy Green Fall Tag 2021 that I created. And there are 12 questions. So number one, is fall your favorite season? Yes, it is. I love it. Number two, what about fall do you like or dislike? Okay, what I don't like about fall is that it starts to get darker earlier. You know how that is. And it always makes me feel like it's time to go to bed. I mean, it does. I go in there in the room and put my pajamas on and my son will come in and say, why do you have your pajamas on so early? You know, it's not even time to go to bed. But it's just something about fall, I guess because it gets darker and it puts you in that type of mood where you want to be relaxed. I think that's what it is. I think it's a subconscious type of feeling that I feel. I know it's too early to go to bed, but I just feel like I want to be comfortable. So I put on my, my pajamas early, you know, like in the evening time, dinner time, you know, between, I could put my pajamas on anywhere between five and seven-ish, sometimes earlier. So that's what I dislike about fall. Okay, number three, did you get married in the fall? And if you did, why did you choose the fall time or why not? Yes, I got married in the fall. I got married in November. November 3rd is me and my husband's 20th anniversary coming up. So I'm, you know, excited about that. Now we chose, well actually, I would say he chose fall, <laughs> not me because he likes the cooler weather. He does not like the traditional June wedding like I do. Now, I, I would have preferred a June or July wedding, but he was like, no, 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 it's too hot, you know, especially having a tuxedo on. And you know, I can't blame him, I really can't, but he chose the fall. So I said, well, what about, because first I chose October, but I don't like the month of October. So I said, well, let's do it the beginning of November. So that's why we got married in the fall, so that it can be cooler for him, so he can be more comfortable. That makes sense. <laughs> okay, number, can't read my writing, so I gotta put these on. Okay, what is your favorite decor style for fall? Well, I love the traditional and I love anything glam. You know, most of my decor, I try to glam it up no matter what, um, what style I have, but I love the traditional colors. The oranges, the browns, the, the tan beige, um, goldish colors, um, things like that. I just love those colors because that, to me, says fall. I just love it. Number five, will this fall season be any different this year than last year? Yeah, I believe so. Yes, it will. Um, especially in here in California, we have a vaccine, um, it's kind of like a vaccine mandate where you have to show that you have a negative COVID test within 72 hours or show that you've been fully vaccinated in order to get into several, not several, but certain businesses. Um, I think it's going to be a lot different, but I still don't want to be gathering and doing a whole lot with a lot of people, so I won't be going in that many places. So, um, but overall, I think it is going to be different. For me, it's gonna be different because I'm not gonna to wanna to go out and go into so many different places. You know, group gathering is what I'm talking about. So that's how it's gonna be different, especially for me and mine. Number six, out of all of the fall colors, Name your number one favorite color. You can only choose one. I'm going to choose orange because orange is just, to me, it just speaks fall. I just love orange, especially my fall mugs that have orange on it, um, different shades of oranges. I just love orange. I mean, browns are nice. All of the colors are nice. I love all fall colors. But if I have to choose, 
I say orange will be my number one favorite. Okay, number seven, do you wear boots in the fall? Why or why not? No, I don't, I don't even have any boots yet. Okay, so I'm gonna say no, I don't wear fall boots. Number one, I can't find any boots that fits my big calves. I have a big calf. I don't have a slim leg, okay, where I can just slip into my boots. Now, I've been trying to find, I haven't looked for anything lately, but the times that I went to the store and, you know, trying to look for boots, I try to find something that's a wide calf, but I, I just can't find it. And the ones that are out there, they're just too expensive, you know, for me right now. You know, I have to buy something a little more on a budget. So, um, that's why I don't wear boots, but I love boots. I mean, it's been so many years that I have worn boots. I don't even know if I, if I would feel comfortable in a boot. Gosh, it's been so long. But that's why I don't wear them because I haven't found a pair that fits. Number eight, your favorite fall drink. Hot drink and a cold drink. So you have to choose a hot drink and a cold one. Okay, my favorite hot drink would be coffee. I love my coffee. I mean, when I get up in the morning, guys, I look forward to going in there and perking my coffee. I mean, I just do. I feel so happy. It makes me feel cheerful. <laughs> and that's any time of the season. I just love coffee. Now, as far as my favorite cold drink, um, well, I don't have a favorite fall cold, cold drink. Um, after I drink my coffee, I start drinking water. So water is not a favorite. And since I don't have any cold uh, fall drinks, I'm gonna choose water. There are other drinks I do like. I just don't really drink them because of the sugar content. I try to limit um, sweet drinks. I may have one once in a while, but not too often. I'll just stick with water, okay? But that's not my favorite cold drink though. <laughs> Number nine, do you travel during the fall season? No, not really. I haven't traveled in a long time. Um, I can't even tell you the, the last time I traveled somewhere other than going to a different city, but you know, getting on the airplane, going somewhere for a vacation. It's been a long time, so I'm well overdue. Okay, 10, will you travel this year? If so, where, and if not, why not? Probably not, no. Um, there's a lot of places to go, but cash flow right now is not where I would like it to be. And the fact that this pandemic is still going on, I'm not comfortable getting on an airplane, being cooped up with all these people and then with all of the fighting that they do on those planes. I don't wanna be around all of that. Number 11. Do you plan to get together with family and friends this year? And explain how the visit will go. I don't know right now what we're going to do. It's a possibility we could visit some family members. I don't know. We have not been invited. No one has talked about what's going to happen, you know, what we're going to do. So, um, and I want to limit that anyway. I don't, I'm not comfortable with getting together with large groups of people. I just want to keep it safer. I think it's safer if you're going to get together a very small group or just stay home and maybe invite one or two people over. That That's kind of how I feel about the holidays this year. Um, that, that's how I feel. I, I don't want to get together with large groups and all the hot well, it's not, it's not cold now, not here in California yet. But when it does, you know, with the heater on and everything and just germs floating around, it's just my mind is just going right now thinking about all that. So I'm not that quite comfortable with gathering. So we'll see. Question number 12. Do you plan on wearing a mask if you do go out? And will you require, if people come to your house, will you require guests to wear a mask at your home? Why or why not? Ah, 
I probably will wear one. At least I'm going to have one with me. I have to, if I'm going somewhere, I have to kind of observe the setting. I have to observe the people, you know, how are we grouped together? How is everybody gathered, you know, on the couch? How is everybody sitting pretty much? Um, and I might show up with it on and then if I feel comfortable, I'll take it off. If not, I'll keep it on. And I don't care what anybody thinks. As far as anybody coming here, um, Mmm, I don't know yet. I haven't talked it over with my husband. Um, and besides, if we invite somebody here, I'm pretty sure we're gonna invite somebody that we know has been vaccinated. Um, that's only if we have anybody here. Cause the way I feel about it, I just don't want, I don't wanna be around people, period. I'm just being honest, I'm just not, 100% comfortable. So I got to play around with it and see. I, you know, there are no definite yes or no's right here. It's just, I just got to wait and see. But anyway, those were the questions that I thought of. I hope you guys like it. Now I'm going to tag several people. So please check the description box. And if you see your name, your channel name in there, please, if you'd like to, no strings attached, do the tag. I would really love to hear your answers and let's spread it, spread it on to other people. So tag, you're it if you're watching. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new here, welcome. And if you have not yet joined the Jazzy Green family, go ahead and click on that subscribe button. Give me a big thumbs up if you like this video and I will see you guys later. Bye.